Dream rules are now in effect in this one. Anything goes from here on out. That's right, Cole. If these superstars can dream it, they are absolutely free to do it. There's nothing standing in the way of their most ambitious and sadistic imaginings. And that definitely made solid impact. So ruthless. Outside of the ring now. What's the plan here? And here we go. Things just got interesting. Into the ring again. DDT! Oof. And he said, you're not getting me with that this time. Hoist it all the way up. Brain Buster! Gonna turn your cranium inside out with that. Up high! Through the air! And connects! Showing absolutely no apprehension to putting one's body on the line. Samoa drop! Incredible! Rollins might need to adapt a little better after that. Reed wanted to make an impact on the opposition, and he just did. Nice suplex. Except as being overwhelmed. Yeah, the Ozilla is proving hard to keep up with. Ooh. Oh, what a strike to the back. Hoist it up. Vertical suplex. Given the no disqualification modifier on this match, Corey, what kind of tactics should you expect to see here? Ruthless tactics. Oh, maybe time to start burning it down. Rollins is starting to roll. He thinks he has it. And a kick out at two. Couldn't quite slam the door yet. Repositioning their opponent. Looks like a neck breaker. Ooh. Ooh, bang! Whoa, stiff headbutt. I don't know what they're looking for here. We've seen the sledgehammer many times before, and it has never been a pretty sight. And these attacks are spelling nothing but trouble. Just like that, Rollins dodges. There is nothing but malintent behind each of these attacks. And you never want to count a competitor out, but there seems to be no signs of defense right now. And things are just going from bad to worse. This is just getting uncomfortable at this point. And it is getting downright nastier and nastier with each of these attacks. This has to be stopped. The cumulative damage here is going to have long-term effects. This is getting more and more alarming with each uninterrupted attack. And it is clear the mission now is to destroy and incapacitate. God, I wonder what he's thinking about when he sets it up here. And Reed is taking command of this one. And Rollins in need of salvation. Turning the tables. Now Rollins looking for some momentum. Seth weathered the storm and wants to create a flurry of his own. Oh, Seth Rollins. Pedigree! And I bet Seth's been plotting that move all match long. Visionary offense from the Drip God. He's looking for something. This could get dangerous. Determination in his eyes, and now a kendo stick in his hands. But right hands create separation and an escape. Clearly hoping something nefarious is beneath the ring. And he's got the hardwood in hand, and you have to imagine a sinister plan for what comes next. You can see the battle scars on their bodies, and they are telling an epic tale. These men are showing everyone the desire, the strength, and the will it takes to compete at this level.
And now Reed is thriving off the audience. Thrown out of ringside and back to the mat. Hoist it high up and sit it on the axe driver. Can Reed close it out for the win? Two. What? Only two? Wow, what a kick out. I am amazed at the fight. Seth Rollins is great. Is there any fight left in Rollins? Two. For Bronson Reed. Bronson Reed must be thrilled with this outcome. I guess that's the face he makes when he.